Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's makeup look is going to be on this palette, which is the Urban Decay um, Alice Through the Looking Glass inspired palette. I picked this palette up today, wasn't expecting to or wasn't even trying to look for it. I actually didn't even know that it was out or that anything like this was out. Um, so basically you take it out the box and it looks like this and you open it and it has a mirror and these little pockets that you kind of just open. Oh, it does go fall. So you kind of just open and it's like a little butterfly. So then you pull it down and you get all the colors that are in this palette. So, Urban Decay does say that they're all new shades. So these colors all vary from very colorful to just cool shades, like reflection, chessboard, you could just wear on a regular day. Then you have some really colorful colors like Hatter and Heads Will Row. The color Cake is my absolute favorite. Um, Royal Flush is like a highlighter color really have some unique colors in this palette so so yeah this is the look that I came up with I am thinking about filming another video tomorrow on something more subtle um, not so colorful but yeah if you want to know how I got this makeup look just keep watching so first things first is I'm going to take my Mac and which just looks like this and on any brush I'm just going to take that and apply it all over my eyelid, or all over my eye period. So after I go in with the color Reflection, which is this color right here, and I'm going to just set that whole set the whole primer with this color. Then taking a fluffy blending brush, I am going to take the color Chessboard, which is this color here, and start applying that all over the crease area. Then taking a flat brush, I'm going to take the color Royal Flesh, which is this color here, and highlight my highlight under the brow bone. Then taking this more precise blending brush, I'm going to go in with the color Time, which is this color here, and just apply that on the outer corner. and then just go in circular motions. Trying to keep that color, just focusing that color in that certain area. And then creating that V effect. Then going in with the color Bandersnatch, this blue right here. I'm going to just take that color and add a very little of it to my lid area only. Then taking a flat brush, I'm going to take the color Cake, which is this color here, and start packing that right, right in the middle of my lid. These colors are really, really pigmented. Now I am going to take this flat brush and I'm going to 
uh, spray some Fix Plus on it. This is going to help intensify this color that we're going to use on the outer lid. It's called Paradox, which is this color here. So just taking that on a flat dance brush and just going to apply that all over the inner corner of my lid area. At the same time, I'm kind of going and diffusing these harsh lines. And then whatever color you feel you lose pigmentation on, you can just go ahead and dab up. Now going in with a flat little brush. This is from Real Techniques. It's called a shading brush. I'm going to take the color Hatter, which is this color here, and I'm going to just apply that color all on my lower lid. Then going in with a flat brush like this, I'm going to take the color Time this, the one that we put on our outer corner, and then just really, really, really thinly apply that right under, right up top of that color. Just, just to get a little bit more of the definition. Then taking the, this NYX NYX glitter liner, I'm just gonna go ahead and take that and run it right under my lid. So just want to add a little bit of glitter to give it that little extra pop. So now going back here and try to buff everything out, I'm going to go in with the color chessboard, the same one that we used in the beginning. And I'm just going to dab very little on this blending brush kind of just sweep all those, blend all those colors together. Then going in with Black Track from MAC and I use the MAC 210 brush, liner, liner brush. I'm just going to go ahead and go in and create a winged liner. this brush makes it so easy to apply gel liner so now I'm just taking the 113 lashes and then up top of that I'm gonna go in with the color this is from NYX. It's in the color aqua green. And I'm just going to add some of this color to the waterline. Then taking the Better Than Sex mascara, I'm just going to add mascara to my top lashes. Well, to connect my real lashes to the fake lashes. Then taking the L'Oreal Telescopic in carbon black, I'm going to add mascara to the lower lashes.
Also for my lips, I took the color Crush by Anastasia. It's one of the new liquid lipstick that came out in her line. Um, and up top of it, I went up with the NYX NYX Butter Gloss. So I combined these two together. This is the color Crush, and this is number 08 from the NYX or NYX Butter Gloss collection. And so there you have it. This is the final makeup look. It's definitely very playful and colorful. Everything that I use will be in the description box below. Everything that I use for my face, lips, eyes, um, moisturizer, primer. Make sure to follow me on Instagram or any of my social medias will all be linked down below. And if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, like, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys later. Bye.